I know Dame was on that series, the episode one, I guess. So I'm kicking it with my man. What's happening? His name's Taj. He's a um, guitarist. Yeah, well, Dame helped me develop it. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. Talk a little bit about healing as gangster. Like, yeah. let's That's talk your about, program, right? Yeah, let's talk yeah. about the, um, you know, I, I, that, I know Dame was on that series, the episode one, I guess. So I'm kicking it with my man. What's happening? His name's Taj. He's a um, guitarist. Yeah, well, Dame helped me develop it. By the press, it's not the truth. And the purpose of me having an outlet to so let's talk about how you him even got to know each other. You know, okay. let, let's be let's let's get to the nitty gritty. You know what I mean? Like, how did you end up meeting Dame Dash? Dame is from Harlem. Yeah, you know, he's not from out here. You know, right. and and but he came out here, and I remember he was out here because I always been a big fan of. He was out here for like ten years. Correct. I've been yeah. a big fan of his. Like I was like, man, this dude right here, because I felt like. We've been in those rooms where he, I felt like he stood for his people. I remember seeing him on a panel where Andy Hilfiger and Carl Kanai was at Magic, and he just pretty much, once he get, gets to talking, yeah, it's he, like he, he yeah. like, uh, like he there for me. You know what I mean? Like the things he's saying is, is really hidden on, on points to where I feel good about being who I am to see a brother up there handling himself in that way. So okay. just give me a little bit of spiel on how you and him linked up. Oh uh, well, you know I had seen him in passing, just kind of being in the game. But I actually had really, really met him through uh, my home girl uh, Brianna. Brianna was on Growing Up Hip Hop. Um, some of y'all that watch that show yeah, might yeah. know who she is. Uh, me and her kind of came up together. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people would see Brianna and they were like, "Oh yeah, you know Mary J. Blige's stepdaughter, blah 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 blah, industry this." She come from the hood. <laughs> okay, she done. We done hustled together, all that. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? So. Uh, you know, kind of growing up like that, you know, she knew what was going on with me. Um, she knew I was in school and she knew what I was doing. So she would call me a lot of times to ask me things, you know, if she was going through something, you know, I'll try to help her. You know, we yeah. help each other. Of course. You know what I'm saying? Um, and a lot of stuff. So she's solid, super solid. Shouts out to her. But um, one day I was driving home from uh, dropping my son off and um, she had called me and uh, she was telling me about a situation with, uh, with Boogie. Okay. Which was Dame's son. Yeah, Bug. yeah, definitely. Yeah. I know Bug. And um, you know, he was have you know, he was having some trouble at that time, dealing with some issues. And uh, you know, she was asking me about, you know, my input on it, you know, of how course. to deal with it because she knew I was I could come from a clinical perspective. And um so we had a long conversation about it on the phone and she was like, You know what? You need to come help me. And I was like, Okay. And she was like, nah, for, nah, I'm, we're going to bring you on the show. I'm, I want you to meet Dane. And I was like, for sure. And she hit me. She was like, yo, you want to do the show? And I'm like, yeah, I want to do the show, for sure. I mean, that's the plan I had anyway. anyway. The whole time I've been in school, I always knew I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take this to TV because I knew there was nobody like me. There's nobody that's from the hood that did this. Correct. That's a psychologist. It's not, you're not going to see it. Well, I hope you see it. But up until this point, you, yes, you haven't it's, seen it's it like far between. Yeah. But right. you will be that so, inspiration to others once they see you on that exactly. TV that, you know what, I don't have to continue in this life. I can turn around. Because people be wondering, how can I give back? Yeah. How can I give back? They don't realize how they can give back. Or, but or again, just how can I turn my life around? Or how can I turn yeah, my life I mean? around? Exactly. But, but what you need to also speak on is some people might not want to go to school for that 10 years. Yeah. But they still want to help people. Which can they? Can. they? Yeah, absolutely. I didn't need these degrees to do it. Okay. I just knew what my goal was, so I knew that the first thing that they was gonna say was, he ain't got no degree. He ain't got no da da da. And they gonna try to assess me to the thug group. Oh, he just a gangster, he on whatever. I got the degrees. You can't tell me shit. <laughs> big big you know congrats on that. Yo, 